Word that San Francisco's indoor mask mandate will soon be lifted in most settings got around fast. It'll be nice getting back to normal, but, you know, we had to do what we had to do. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's good. That's okay with me. I don't pay much attention. I mean, whatever, you know, whatever they say. San Francisco Public Health Officer Dr. Susan Phillips says the timing makes sense here with the local numbers going in the right direction. Because our case rates are coming down and because of our immense level of vaccination and boosting in the city, we're able to align with the state. The change means starting on February 16th, people will be able to enter San Francisco supermarkets, salons, restaurants, just about any indoor setting without wearing a mask if they're fully vaccinated. Masks will still be required at hospitals, shelters, schools, and because of federal rules, all public transportation. Businesses can still require masks if they choose, and anyone can still wear a mask indoors if they like. Lifting the mask mandate in most places next week, along with state guidance, is a relief for some, but it's also a concern for others. We have a population of children between six months and five years old who have been waiting very expectantly for vaccines to be available. And we, that might actually be a reality for many families, myself included, in about a week. And so I'm just wondering why we can't wait a little bit longer. The FDA is meeting this weekend to consider data on vaccines for younger children. The review panel is expected to make an announcement on that data next Tuesday. Dr. Phillips says she still recommends everyone continue wearing masks indoors until case rates drop further, but she's comfortable making this next step. What we're able to do now is remove that legal requirement of that order and saying that it is uh, mandated by the health officer and by the city. And really, it's coming back now into the hands of the people of San Francisco, and I feel really confident with it being there. In San Francisco, Sergio Quintana, NBC, Bay Area News.